Hey everybody, it's Paul Yokobitis from Cary State Planning back with another video as part of our 2020 video challenge. And today I want to begin a series of videos about non-legal tips that you can do today to make life easier for your end of life and after you're gone. So today I want to talk about beneficiary designations. And this is something that we preach as part of uh, overall comprehensive estate planning anyway, but it's entirely non-legal. So what I mean by that is your 401k and your IRA, your Roth, your life insurance, and those sorts of accounts that you set up and they ask you for things like primary and secondary designations. You wanna make sure that those are filled out appropriately and that they're updated over time. So anytime that you change employers or anytime that you set up new accounts, you wanna make sure that those accounts have primary and secondary beneficiaries. And if they do, then they're gonna make the transfer of those assets a lot easier than if the assets were uh, undesignated. So across the board, financial accounts, anything investment, life insurance related, make sure that they're beneficiary designated, make sure that those assets stay out of probate and they make their way to the intended beneficiaries as easy as possible. It's Paul from Cary State Planning.